Hello everyone, welcome to my channel GoHesti. My channel name is a combination of GoHe and Esti, which stands for Korea and Estonia. GoHe in French means Korea and Esti means Estonia in Estonian. As of today, January 1st, 2021, I've decided as my New Year's resolution to study Estonian. This is not for an exam, but just for fun, so I will take it easy, but under one condition. It is to study every single day, no matter how long I spend each day. Whether it's just one minute, five minutes, or one hour a day, my goal is to continue without missing a single day. When it comes to learning a foreign language, I think the most important part is to study it every single day. It's very easy to skip a day, so I created a YouTube channel today to motivate myself. I'm planning to record some of Estonian vocabularies or phrases with my thoughts when I have time, and I'm thinking of uploading once a week or once every other week. So, let's see how long I stick to my gore. This channel is intended to keep me motivated, but it would be awesome if I could help anyone to learn any foreign languages. I have once watched a video of a polyglot YouTuber um, who speaks more than 10 languages. It was surprising and inspiring. Her channel is called Polyglot Stories, and I will put the link of the video I watched it in my description. I don't speak as many languages as she does, but if I could inspire anyone to think, oh, I can do it too, or um, it's not a big deal to start it, that would be encouraging me. If you're interested in Estonian as well, you're very welcome to watch my video for fun, and I recommend that you visit a great website, Kieliklik. Uh, I hope my pronunciation is correct. You can check the link in the description. So far, I have talked about my channel, and now I would like to introduce a little bit about myself as well. As you can guess from my channel name, I am Korean, and I traveled in Estonia only once in my life in 2012. Since then, I have been interested in Estonia. Listening to Estonian songs is one of my hobbies, and I'm sure that nobody in Korea listens to Estonian songs as much as I do. However, I hadn't really considered learning the Estonian language before the COVID-19 came. Last December, Korea tightened social distancing measures, and it was the toughest time of the year. To make the most of time at home, I was thinking of learning a new language. Suddenly, Estonian came across my mind. On December 12, 2020, I googled how to learn Estonian and I found a useful website called Kieliklik. I was surprised to remember that my Dutch friend had recommended this website five years ago. At that time, I had never imagined I would learn Estonian. As I liked the website, I started studying Estonian right away the day I found it. Thanks to short animations, I enjoyed it, but I missed one day, so I failed to reach my goal. Hopefully, I can achieve my goal this year. Thank you for watching. Heya daiga!